hello guys welcome to my youtube channel rishi labs in today's video we will see how to download ssms ssms stands for sql server management studio so let's get started for this you require web browser i'll make use of google chrome in the search bar you need to type ssms download and press enter you'll get the first link download sql server management studio click on it scroll down here is the link to download SSMS. You need to click on this link. This is going to download the setup file. So setup download is completed. I'll click on open. Close the web browser as we don't need it. On this screen, you can click on run. So this is a window for installation Microsoft SQL Server Management Studio. If you want, you can change the default directory, but I would recommend go with the default location. Now click on install. You'll get a pop up select yes. All right, SSMS has installed successfully. You can see the message setup completed. Click on close. To start SSMS, you need to click on Windows key. In search, type SSMS. You'll get the app icon. Click on open. This will start the SSMS. Over here, in server type, to connect to a SQL server, you need to select the server type database enter the server name in authentication mode you need to select required authentication as in previous video i have installed sql server 2022 on this machine so it has auto captured all those details in authentication mode i'll go with the windows authentication you can see the username for encryption in drop down you need to select optional then click on connect this will connect you to the sql server on the left side object explorer you can see you can expand this database you can see the system database available so that's how you can connect to sql server now if you want to write your own script you can select the server click on new script new query now this is the query page in this drop down you can see the database name master model msdb tmdb all these are the system databases you need to create your own database and start writing your scripts in next video we'll see how to write script how to query database how we can create your own tables okay so i'm going to make series on that so to disconnect from the server you need to click select it in the object explorer and you can see the disconnect button you can click on it i'll close this file and close the ssms do subscribe to my youtube channel rishi labs thanks for watching